going to go ahead and do some uh, preliminary assembly of pieces. That way we can get rid of some of the little bits and we're not chasing them around. So what I want you to do is take two of your uh, medium vinyl end caps, uh, two of the seven. There are seven medium sized vinyl end caps. And you're going to take your dihedral fitting and where the crossbars come in on the angle, I want you to insert the closed end of the vinyl into the dihedral, slide it down until it stops, turn it over, and insert the second one. And just go ahead and push it down and seat it. And what we're going to end up doing uh, when we build the kite is that the two crossbars that we have, the 430 millimeter uh, by 3 millimeter diameter fiberglass rod, will be inserted into these end caps, seated down in, and that creates the dihedral of the kite. Just like that. Okay, so we'll remove those set these aside and we'll use them in a little later in we'll use the crossbars a little later when we're assembling the kite next what I want you to do is take one more of the actually let's uh, bring these out there's three of those all together and what we're going to do first is we're going to take and make two short pieces. We're going to take two short pieces off of this vinyl and we want them a quarter inch long. So somewhere on your yardstick there's an inch mark, happens to be 17 inches, and there's the quarter inch mark there. Set your vinyl over that with your exacto knife make a just don't cut all the way through because you don't want to cut into your uh, into your yardstick but just go ahead and slice it a little bit then you can move it back and then push down to create one short piece measure out another quarter inch slice that a little bit come down and cut through. Now we have two short quarter inch pieces of vinyl. This piece is uh, now a waste piece but hang on to it just in case. Go ahead and set that aside. Then what we're going to do with these two pieces is that we're going to end up, we're going to fold them in half. Because what we want is we want the end cap to look like this when we're finished. We want a nice notch right there. So to create that, we're going to use the wire cutters and the vinyl and we're going to fold that vinyl into thirds. So fold this over until you have one half until you have one half of the vinyl showing or covered. So, so we're, we're folding it into thirds. And then you're going to take your wire cutter and right on the corner There's the halfway point there, a little bit farther up, 45 degrees, and you're going to snip off a little piece. Now you have an opening there. The other thing you're going to do is you're going to take your X-Acto knife and snip off the end, the closed end, right where the radius 
makes its transition right there is where we want to trim it at and bring it back onto your cutting mat and trim off the end now we have this little bird's mouth and this will be used for your leading edge fitting so once again we fold it over so that we have two-thirds of the vinyl there and one-third of the vinyl here snip off a little bit of the corner and cut off the tip so what we have now this is our leading edge spar that's the long one, the 705 millimeter. And we're going to slide this into the short end, like that. And we're going to bend it and slide it down. Take your other leading edge and do the same. This is the other leading edge spar slide it into the short end, bend the vinyl. Just like that. And then we can slide these down towards the end. Or, if you want to get make it easier, you can open it up and slide it in. Because we want, to, we want the short end close to the one end of the of the spar, like that, the leading edge. Now, take your last two medium-sized vinyls and we're going to put these end caps on the leading edge. As you can see, they slide very easily. These caps are a little too big for this rod. So what we're going to do we're going to take a piece of your magic tape, about an inch and a quarter piece. There you've got close to a little more than an inch and a quarter. And you're going to stick it on the end of the end of this leading edge spar. Turn it into a flag. And then you will take that and Roll it. I'm roll. I'm turning the spar to roll that on. You can see there. Okay, and rub it with your fingers. And then you can take your vinyl, the medium-sized vinyl, and it slides on and holds on nicely. Then take this vinyl and slide it down there. Now you have an end cap. You have your leading edge fitting on your leading edge spar. Set that one aside and do the same thing for this one. About an inch and a quarter piece of tape. Line it up to the end. Roll it on. Slide this down onto there and you've got a nice snug fit. Slide that down, set that aside. Okay, now your leading edge spars are ready to insert into the sail when we get to that point.